look at this one. First one of these we've had here at Unique, especially in Classics. 1908 Sears Motor Buggy. These are actually only produced between 1908 to 1912 by Sears. This particular one came from Evansville, Indiana. They were originally produced by the Hercules Buggy Plant before moving to Chicago and the Hercules Buggy Plant was in Evansville, Indiana. And uh, since this is a 1908, they actually moved in 1909 to Chicago. This is believed to be one of the original ones. If you want to check out the still pictures, try to go all around this, give you some shots of the underside. Still pictures can be seen at uniqueclassiccars.com. Click on the link down below this video in the description. It's going to take you right there. And of course, you can call us 507 386 1726. A lot of the parts are handcrafted, made to the correct dimensions, and made to function as the original, with the exception of the engine and hydrostatic drive transmission. These wheels were actually made in Indiana by the Amish. They are wood wheels, wood spoked wheels. The original pieces to this car, of course, would be the fender, all four, frame. Um, some of the wood was still intact, but again, then refabricated to resemble as closely as possible an original Sears motor buggy. Now has a Kohler power plant in it. It does have electric start with a key switch up right where the driver would be located at. There's the actual number of it, 1098 Sears motor buggy. There's also a little write up board over here that will be included with it. A little information on the history of these. And again, that can be seen in the still pictures too at uniqueclassiccars.com. Just click on the link down below this video in the description. We'll take you right there. And you can look these up, watch videos on them. You'll see them out there. Um, this is actually for the steering. Turn the wheels in the front, left or right. This here would be the throttle and choke. Going back to the Kohler engine. Electric start switch right there. As I understand, forward and reverse is right here. And then you would push on this pedal. I believe that engages the belt and transmission system. Other side would be the brake. And again, you can call with, uh, consult with the sales associates when you call in. Uh, this is kind of a setup. When this is screwed out, we can push it around. Um, if you're going to drive it, you actually screw this in. That will tighten the tension on the belt so it can be in running and driving order then. There you go, a quick little rundown on a 1908 Sears motor buggy. Give us a call, 507-386-1726, uniqueclassiccars.com. Click on the link down below this video in the description. It's going to take you right there. Look forward to hearing from you on this one.